this program and today by the special grace of God I'm going to continue my teaching on go forward part 9 and I believe you have been following all our podcast uh, so please uh, stay tuned the Lord bless you as you go in Jesus day. today I'll be talking about breaking mental barrier one and I will pick that from the attitude of the spies and so just to start with, Proverbs 28, verse 7, the Bible says, For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. As he thinketh in his heart, so is he. There is an attitude in you. There is a kind of barrier that you have already created yourself that you need to break. And so when I'm talking about breaking mental barrier, I call it mental barrier because it's something in you that you need to work on. There's an obstacle you have created yourself that you need to remove. There's an image in your heart that you need to deal with. The attitude of the spy, I just pick one attitude today. And if God permits, I will continue. Uh, just, just make sure you follow up. You know, in number chapter 13, verse 31. I pick the first one. Doubt. These ten spies, they have the, the doubting, a doubting mind. They said in verse 31, we are not able. We are not able. They themselves said it. Doubt causes them to question their resources to take the land. They doubted God. The question, even God. So I just mentioned three aspects of this doubt. Number one, you can doubt God. You can doubt God. Number two, you can even doubt yourself. Number three, you can doubt the community or the society or the system. When I say doubt God, Mark 11, 22 to 24, Jesus was explaining there. He said, have faith in God. That is to say, put your trust in God. Believe in God. Believe in the Lord. That's what Jesus was saying. And he says that if you ask for anything and you do not doubt, say you will surely receive it. There is no power that can stop you from receiving it. There is no demon, there is no influence that can stop you once you make up your mind. With God, you believe God, I believe with you, nothing is impossible, he'll give it to you. As soon as you begin to doubt, then you have, you have failed. Number two, you can doubt yourself. You can doubt yourself. What are the capacities that are in you? You know what God said in James, James 1, 5 to 6? He said, an unwavering man cannot receive anything from God. So you can't keep on wavering. You can't keep on not being stable. It's something we have to work on. They that needed wisdom, let him ask of God, who give liberally and obey them not. These ten spies, they doubt God, they doubt themselves. They even doubt the community. They begin to doubt this. That's one thing that you and I need to work on. There are some of us when you go for an interview and you just suddenly see that the man who championed the cause, oh, is from one region, is with one color, you, are already, you have already concluded in your mind that you have failed the interview. So be careful of the doubt you have created in your own heart. Learn to overcome every doubt with faith. Learn not to be fearful. Learn to walk with a determined mind that I know I can do all things in Christ who strengthens me. And with this, the barriers are removed. I wish you the best this week. The Lord bless you. The Lord empowers you. The Lord guide your path. Go in peace. In Jesus' name. Amen.